Hi, I'm Raymond, and today I'm going to show you how to set up and navigate your new Chromebook. First, let's set it up. Before you begin, you'll need your Google account username and password, along with internet access. If you don't have a Google account, go to google.com forward slash accounts to create one. Make sure your Chromebook is plugged in, and then press the power button. Once your Chromebook turns on, you'll see on-screen instructions that ask you to choose your language and network, and then sign in with your Google account. Now you'll choose your profile picture. You can always come back and update this later. Now that you're all set up, I'll show you the basics of navigating your new Chromebook. This is your desktop. Your Chromebook's desktop does not include icons. On the bottom of the desktop, you'll see what's called the shelf. This is where you can access apps that are pinned or currently running. On the bottom right, next to your profile picture, is the status tray, which contains quick access to your settings. On the bottom left, you'll see a circle icon. This is the apps launcher. To view all of your apps, click the app launcher and then the all apps icon. To create a folder of your apps, just drag one app onto another, like so. And for easy access, you can pin them to the shelf by two finger clicking and selecting Pin to Shelf. To view your Chromebook status and settings, open the status area by clicking your profile picture on the bottom right. From the status area, you'll find your networks, battery life, settings, and more. There's also a question mark icon which is the Get Help app. Here, you can search for help articles within Chromebook. To change your settings, click Settings. You can search for what you want to change, like wallpaper. Let's go through some touchpad and keyboard tips to help you navigate your Chromebook. Use two fingers and move them up or down to scroll. To right-click, do a two-finger click. For a map of keyboard shortcuts, press Control, Alt, and question mark. Depending on which key you hit, you'll see the corresponding shortcut. That's it. You're all set to start using your new Chromebook. For more information on getting started, visit the Google Help Center or the Get Help app. 